Or she. If one of these is a girl, apparently. I don't know which. I don't care either. Well, I guess this was clearly the boy. No shirt, and he's playing with airplanes. Jingling, blah blah blah. We get it. I probably should just run through the exit. <laughs> oh, I'll just be glad to get through this part because actually, after this, there's some gameplay. Yay! I mean, we, we had one fight with Klungo, and I guess that was kind of it. King Jingling happens to open the doors in your house, so anybody can get in. Alright, it is more Isla Hags, Wooded Hollow area. That guy must have a really, really booming voice for us to be able to hear him all the way out here. There. Die. Pterodactyl thing. Open up that uh, silo for later. Let's head on in. Wouldn't Jiggy Wiggy just... Uh, or whatever the guy's name is. Yeah, the Jiggy Wiggy. Uh, just tell a doorman, hey... These guys are going to fulfill some sort of prophecy, so let them in. No? You're so worthy to enter, you must collect images, blah blah blah. We need to collect jiggies, we know. So did Mr. Jiggy have a body? Because he could, I don't know, talk at, you know, that one point when you collect your first jiggy in the first game. Why am I asking all these dumb questions? I just want to play. <laughs> Also make jiggies. Om nom nom. Alright, we got past the doorman, and now we have to talk even more. Oh. <laughs> Love of God! The sacred temple of Jiggy Wiggy. Yes, we know. Yay, alright. This is the part that a lot of people can't record because they use emulators, but I'm not using an emulator, so we can actually show this. I won't have to do any cutting out. Not that it's really that entertaining, it's just you have to put a puzzle together. For you if you wish to travel to where it shows, yep. And the background is stuff that's happening in that world right now. And there's some really big fat guy back there, playing with his money. Ugh, I'm just gonna skip all this dialogue, I know how to do this. You only have limited time, and it, I think it gets a little bit shorter as you go along. Usually there's more than enough time though. Uh, let's see. I do have a problem with these a little bit, only because they're not, like, they're not really that hard. But most of the pieces are the same shape, and sometimes... Like that, uh, wait, what? I think I put those in the wrong spot, I don't know. The fact that everything's gold makes it really hard to, to tell. I put the, yeah, I mixed those up. Sometimes you, regardless of how uh, well you place a piece, it will still, uh, acknowledge it as, or say it's wrong like that, and that buzzing noise is really annoying. There. The key to really doing this easily without even having to think about it, I mean, most of the edge pieces are very easy to figure out, but later when you need to flip things around, uh, you can tell where things are supposed to go based the, pu the, the puzzle pieces themselves, the jigsaw pieces, actually also have the scene on them, so it, it makes it easier to tell where they're supposed to go just based on that. And now the great power of that crystal jiggy, for some reason. And you might hear this, my rumble pack is going berserk. It hasn't done anything yet. 
but now it's deciding to actually work. This isn't even an original NES controller, it's some knockoff super pad that I bought at Radio Shack because my original controller broke years ago. That's annoying, I'm taking this out. Yeah. All right, a level. Woohoo! I am headed there right now. Now I'm in good spirits because now we can actually do stuff. You do not have enough. Blah 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 blah. I know. I just started the game. Come back later. Why is it stopping me from moving? This is an information signpost. I thought I already read these. Well, there's a couple behind uh, Jiggy Wiggy over there. There's a secret room, but I don't need those those signs. Don't need them one bit. Uh, all right. Let's head to our first world. For the first time ever. And we go to uh, this this place. It is called Mayhem Temple, or yeah, Mayhem Temple? No, Mayhem probably. I don't know. Hey, warp pads. We'll need these a lot in every world because they're very, very useful. And there's, I mean, there's some places you can't actually get characters. Uh, without getting them, without using those warp pads like Mumbo's, and, and uh, Mumbo will need those, I'm sure. Breaking the game by saying stuff that happens. Yippee! One of. F Yay, alright, we found our first Jinjo, and now it's. Uh, we get it, he's back in his house. Just let me play. Oh, I didn't get that up there, I keep forgetting. That uh, Trouble Clef with 20 notes. And we will. We will save all of them because we get jiggies for it. And we want to get out of the water. Nothing else down there. We can't go up that way yet. We need to move. Ooh, notes. We want the notes. In fact, let's switch to Kazooie. You found some notes, boy. Yes, character, we have no idea who he is yet. Oh! It's Mumbo! Great shot. Great magic, huh? Let's go talk to Tubby. Whoa. I want that spear. Let me have it. It'll make the game a lot easier. We want to go in there as it sounds cool. Kickball again. <laughs> Officer, you know go pass. Has. Uh. Yes, because a bear and bird can totally enter a game meant for its stonies. No. <laughs> what will we even bribe this guy with? We only have feathers and eggs. Uh, we we. Managed to anger the doorman. So now we can't get in, so let's just keep going. So it's a, it's a Moggy enemy type. Screw that sign. We don't need that sign. And that's a really weird looking face. Whoa. Let's get... Whoa, 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 whoa. Press B. You got it, man. We have 40 notes. And this is Drill Sergeant uh, Sergeant Marshy. No, it is Jam Jars, and uh, we learn all our moves from him because he's a mole and Bottle's brother. But they're advanced moves! Woo! Which I guess is pretty cool. We get to keep all the originals and build on those. Most of the moves are pretty useful, I think. 
Not all of them, but, you know, most of them are there. And that's a really short grieving period, but, you know, whatever. We're gonna bring him back to life. There's no need to worry about that sort of thing. Pa. 